All right, you ready? Quiz time. It's an easy quiz because obviously you know what you're watching. Who has scored 49 runs in the last five games they played? It is the Chicago Cubbies. Listen, guys, I came on about a week ago saying, man, this stretch here at the end of the month is all so important, and they need to take probably five or six, right, from Pittsburgh and Washington. So I think now that those series have happened, I should re re reconvene and say something. So over the past week, I've made a few videos, right, about the Cubs, right? Obviously about they can push there, right? Um, what's the weaknesses, right? Throughout the year, I said relief pitching. Okay, what if I told you relief pitching has been great? Starting pitching has been great. The bottom of the order turned into the best bottom of the order in baseball. And then the entire one through nine became the best one through nine in baseball. 49 runs in five games is not normal. And I'm not going to act like it's normal. The stats the Cubs are putting up right now are only comparable to their 84 team. Uh, some great teams in the 40s that they had. Some early 1900 teams. This is not only rare air for uh, any baseball team, by the way. This is for the Cubs. This team has been around since the beginning of baseball. And they're doing things that haven't been done since that time. This offense right now is on a torrid pace. So what is next? One month left. This is it for all teams. And the only two teams ahead of the Cubs, away from the wild card spot, is the Mets and the Pesky Braves. And man, it's three and a half games at the red hot moment of this recording of this video that the Cubs are back. Who would have thought that the Cubs would be three and a half games back of the wild card? For any of you guys wondering, is Luke going to focus more on football than baseball? It will be even. I will make sure to give the Cubbies the coverage they deserve. And if they keep playing like this, they will have coverage into October. That's what I'm going to tell you right now, is the Cubs will make the postseason. There is no question about it. We're not going to beat around the bush. I'm not going to give you all this BS narrative, this, that, and the other. I'm going to tell you what I truly and utterly not only believe, but almost know. And that's that the Cubs Cubs will stay hot. The Mets will not. So instantly, that makes me believe that they're going to jump the Mets. What about the Braves, Luke? Braves are an interesting case, right? They get injuries all the time. Acuna has been out for a while. Do you think that they can still make that push? Do I think it's possible? Yes. But do I think it happens? No. I think that the Cubs' schedule is very easy for the rest other than three series. Yankees and Dodgers back-to-backs from the 6th to the 11th. That's tough. That's two of the highest grossing, highest paid teams in baseball. Shohei Otani, Aaron Judge, the MVP of each league, playing the Cubs back to back. But it's a team sport. It's not, it's not a one-man sport. And if you ask me right now, who's the best team currently in baseball at this red hot moment in the last 10, 13 days, I will tell you the Chicago Cubs. If you ask me who's the best team today, Cubs, three days ago, Cubs, seven days ago, Cubs. And this isn't me speaking as a fan. I would tell you if they sucked, if they were trash, if they were playing bad, and they're doing none of it. They are the best team team in baseball right now and there's not a better time to be the best team in baseball and I said in my last video is it too little too late because Cubs were like winning but like you know they weren't doing full huge wins now they have two series sweeps in a row after not sweeping an opponent for a long time this is huge Get the broomsticks out because I'm expecting another sweep coming against Pittsburgh if you want my, my prediction there. And against the Yankees and Dodgers, with the Cubs continuing to play like this, they will take two of three from each of those teams. Then against, uh, I think, Cincinnati or whatever team it is. I think it's a red team, whatever. Or it's Athletics, whoever it is. Give me a sweep against the Athletics. Cincinnati, give me two of three because I don't know, just for some reason, I think they could win one. And then give me two of three against the Phillies. And then to end the year against the Cincinnati Reds, give me a sweep. Meaning, yes, I don't really think the Cubs are going to lose maybe more than four or five for the rest of the year. Is that crazy? Yes. But guess what? It's my take. And that's all I got for you guys. The Cubs are B-A-C-K back, baby. Go Cubs go. Oh, also, Chicago, what do you say? Right, the Cubs won today.